Hello everyone and welcome back to Dog Sled Saga and uh, we are here with what's turned out to be a little bit of a struggle here. We had some tough calls to make last episode and uh, I'm hoping they work out for the better in the end but right now we need to get our race game back on and uh, do the best we can with what we have, continue to work, continue to train, uh, get our dogs back on their feet, get us back on our, our feet and uh, we're going to be doing the best we can. Oops, we do have dogs that were, were idle. That was not what I was hoping for. Um, but yeah, so we're going to be doing the best we can with this. And hopefully getting back into the race here. Uh, even with our, our newer team. And as we get farther down the line, we will be breeding uh, some of the other dogs as well. And then probably retiring them pretty soon after that. As soon as their, their puppy comes home, probably we'll end up uh, retiring them. Now that we have some dogs that are a little more experienced and starting to gain levels in uh, the areas they need to be uh, and again remember the retired dogs they're not they're not dead they're not completely gone they're just running around in the snow having fun but they're no longer actively racing and more importantly in that regard we're not paying their dues <laughs> not that not that I'm happy that they're still here with us I'm definitely happy for that it's not it's not like they're completely gone gone oh heck yeah we're putting we're putting white out in for this race that's for sure um, and we'll put all of these guys in. This is an insanely easy race. Um, we need to get, uh, our natural aptitude dogs back and uh, running. Oh, I should have made sure everybody else was, uh, training. But yeah, so, <laughs> uh, this is gonna be a really easy race. It should be. And, uh, we just need to make sure that we keep our team going and that we're not, um... We want, we want to make sure we're not going to have any issues with the finances, and so having our dogs retire as soon as they're ready to retire is a good idea in the long run, because it'll help mean that we don't have unnecessary expenses for dogs that aren't uh, actively racing anymore, because uh, we just can't afford that at this point in time, honestly. Um, there's not uh, <laughs> there, there's not enough finances to go around for that. Okay, we'll get past this tree, and then we should be able to feed them again. We should be able to, to do this fairly easily. I'm not overly concerned about this race. It's supposed to be very, very simple, uh, but that's not always how it is. And we're trying to earn enough money to make sure that uh, we can make it to the next league. And what we'll try and do is get that done right before we go up to the next level, because if we can do that, then we should be good. And now that we don't have an employee that's costing us, like, a, a ridiculous amount of money because as much as it was kind of fun to have the jerk on our team we just don't need that uh we do we don't need i don't think we need i don't think the perk makes such a huge difference that it's worth paying that amount for uh we have an employee who does have one training perk and uh, i think that's going to be enough for the time being um as long as uh it, it will we'll just make sure we put any new dogs that we're training with us or with them in fact we probably don't even need an employee who's got uh, who's got that perk. We probably could just manage because I believe we have a plus two perk. Yes, we made it into the first. I was a little worried we weren't. Oh, I guess you did catch. I was a little worried we weren't going to, but we did make it. So there we are. And what did we? I think we got specialty. Yes, wheel level specialty two. Report. Oh, report down with hunter. That's fine. Um, two races as lead for whiteout. That's good news. Let's just make sure that we are resting. So we'll go ahead. That's not what I meant to click. <laughs> I was like really confused for a moment there. Uh, but that's what's going on. Okay, put avalanche back in training. Um, we'll make sure that we do the caretaking. We just have to watch our money a little bit more carefully than we did because admittedly we got a bit reckless with it and that's never a good thing in real life, in game, or otherwise. So let's see here. If we keep progressing, we should just be able to, uh, to make it through. There we go. Let's go ahead here. And we got another race in one day. I'll make sure I pet everyone. And we should be ready to be back on our feet soon. We've got 18 days until the bills are due. And we're making good headway. We just gotta keep earning that money. <laughs> and uh, keep making sure we're gonna have enough. Four dog team. Okay then. Let's go ahead. We'll enter. Okay. We're gonna put... I'm gonna put uh, Avalanche in this time. And we'll make sure we put... I'm gonna put Hunter in, I think. Um, I'm gonna put Hunter, yeah, because we want to keep Hunter well trained as well, because he's gonna be here for longer than Aeon is. So we'll put him closer to the back, because then we'll be able to feed him an avalanche, uh, probably at the same time, I think. Make sure Whiteout stays in training. 
And here we go. <laughs> so Hunter should be pretty happy because he has the petting, um, he has the, he likes to be pet, and so that's a good thing. Uh, that's his favorite thing, is what, that's literally what it's called. So, <laughs> um, we just gotta make sure he and Avalanche stay fed, because that'll help a lot. Oh, yeah, we got it, good, all right. And as long as we can do that, okay, oops, stay forward. Okay, oh, do not tangle now, because we, we will get, oh, no, 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 this is not what I wanted to have happen. Okay, feed, 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 feed the dogs, feed the dogs, we've got trouble. <laughs> All right, I think we're good. Oh, no, we're not good. All right, there we go. So, having that rope did help a lot, um, but if we stay on our toes, we can counter it. We just really need to make sure we don't lose that uh, sponsorship money. Um, all right, because... Okay, there we go. Jump quickly. <laughs> we don't want to lose speed there. We don't want to run into the, the rock. That would not be good. And I miss both of you. All right, there we go. Oh, we're out of treats. We're out of treats. Um, there's a restock. We're good. We're good. We're good. All right, come on. Come on. There we go. And there we go. We should be all right. We just got to make sure we come in first every time. If we don't, we might have some problems. Okay, forward. There we go. Got it. Okay, stay forward. Make sure you stay forward. Do Oh, stay forward. <laughs> All right, make sure we feed. Make sure we feed. That was not far enough. That was also probably not far enough. That went to the wrong dog. Oh, stay forward. Stay forward. All right, we can do this. We just got to keep going. All right, there we go. Now we have food again. Now we have food again. I got to I got to watch my timing a little bit more carefully cuz I'm throwing too many treats. All right, come on. We can do this. We can do this. We just gotta stay in first for a little while longer. There we are. Nice job. Avalanche did really well with pulling ahead there. That's good to see. And if we look at all of these guys, everybody's everybody's happy. We got more rapport with Hunter. That's good. We got lead specialty too. That's great. Uh, let's continue on, and I think we're pretty good. Let's just make sure we rest for the day so that our dogs regain their uh, fatigue back, or like they they get. Um, they get to rest and their fatigue goes down. All right, let's see here. Let's make sure if we go, let's go back to training. And we have, so we have two more races. How much money do we need to earn? I think, if we look at the league office, um, oh, we've almost, oh no, this is our current one. I got all excited. So we have to earn uh, 6,400 more. How much? Do we have, have for each race? We're not gonna make it this time. We're gonna <laughs> we're gonna have to sit on this for a little bit and save up a bit more and do it the next round. I'm pretty sure, unless we get insanely lucky with that. Uh, but we should be able to do that because now we're if we're earning eleven, if we've got eleven and we're gonna be earning like we'll have we'll get like five thousand more pretty much because we're almost exactly where we need to be with that. Uh, then we should be good. We should be all right. If need be, I can drop an employee the day before and get a slightly less good one again. Uh, that's not ideal, but it is a possibility. And that would bring us down, like if we look at that, um, if we look at our staff, uh, 950, yeah, we could drop that down and get an additional, um, we could then get an additional uh, employee who has a cheaper, uh, who's a little cheaper to hire but doesn't ha do as good of a job basically because we don't really need all of our dogs to have that uh insane level of that all the time all right you're gonna be in the middle again um if it's an easy race whiteout's going in the front uh it's fairly easy but it'll get her her specialty so we just need to make sure everybody else stays training because really at this point most of the training is just maintenance um it's just making sure that the dogs are at the top of their, uh, the top of their capacity whenever we get there. Pretty much, we're not we're not in any sort of a, a situation where it's going to be a problem. Oh, nice. Okay, please don't get tired. There we go. Make sure we jump. And I missed you. There we go. That was nice because we technically threw it while we were still in the air, and those are harder to judge. You're going to be hungry again. Yep. All right. We just gotta chill out, though, because we're throwing the treats uh, too quickly now. Alright, you and you at the same time. Nope, not quite. But we should be pretty good. Stay forward. Alright. And I think you're not even gonna need it. There we go. 
but we need to make sure we're getting it to them as they're getting tired because otherwise all right perfect there we go just wait a little bit more nope still not perfect now we've got wind all right there we go perfect for you probably pretty close to perfect for you guys not quite all right we just need to make sure we keep winning and uh, I don't want to have to take another dog off the team. I don't want to have to take another set off the team. But we are uh, we are losing time and we are losing finances. Oops, stay forward. All right. I'm going to wait a little bit more. We'll let uh, them get a little more worn out so that we can get that perfect catch. All right. And that's probably going to hit the tree. Yes, it did. But you still caught it. All right. Stay forward. There we go. <laughs> uh, it's hard to hold them back sometimes when they want it, when they want to... Um, when they want to run back for it. So that's probably not the best uh, best ability that they can have because it tends to lead to tangles. That's when we're gonna wanna breed out as time goes on. There we go. See, we do get a little bit of a speed boost for that. That was pretty good, all right. Wait, not just yet. We gotta hold a little bit more. All right, nice. And we are in first. And... We're in first. We're good. Okay. We, we almost looked like we weren't going to make it a little bit at the end there, but we're pretty good now. Oh, did you get your specialty? Yes. Uh, yes, lead specialty one. Rapport up. Rapport up. That's good. All right, so now we'll get uh, now we'll get a little bit of a bonus for that uh, whenever we're racing this team together. So now we now have two lead dogs that we can, uh, we can have here. So what we could do is... Um, if we're gonna breed our dogs, we could breed Rory and uh, Rory and Shasta, or well, what would they be? Um, wheel and lead. That's not ideal. Uh, or we could do well. Chase and Aeon are both wheel dogs, though. We have a bit of a problem with having too many wheel dogs. Um, that is a bit of an issue. <laughs> so let's make sure we care for all the dogs, and uh, then we'll go ahead and see here we'll make sure we go back to training because i don't think none of them are tired right oh uh whiteout has a little bit of fatigue but that's all right she's not going to have issues with it we'll probably get to rest her uh fairly soon because i can't imagine we're going to have all easy races from here on out so let's keep going how are we doing time wise um let's see uh, I think it, the breeding fee, I think, is like 2000 or something, probably. So, 16, or 616 at the moment. Uh, so, we're all right. She's not near 1,000 uh, days on the team yet. So, uh, we're going we're gonna to hang in there for a little bit longer. <laughs> uh, do we? Yeah, we went back to training. Okay. And we'll race uh, one more time, and then we should have a little bit of extra saved up so that we can probably go ahead and breed pretty soon, I think. In fact, maybe we'll do that after we pay our dues. I don't want to have to drop down again, but we now have, uh, if we breed Shasta and Rory, we'll have a trained middle dog and a trained uh, wheel dog that can take their place. So uh, we won't have to worry about that. All right, we got a four dog team. Let's go ahead and hit enter. And okay, so, oh, it's very low. Okay, so we're gonna keep wide out in the lead. Um, let's see, I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put Sierra and we'll put Hunter because Hunter's gonna stay. We'll keep training these guys. They're all pretty happy. And uh, I think we will next time try. Well, let's make sure everybody, yeah, everybody's good. Everybody's training. And then we'll go ahead and try and do the breeding next time. And then that might enable us to retire two of the dogs. In fact, what I'm going to say it would probably be better to do, and I missed. <laughs> what I'm going to say it would probably be better to do would be to breed Chase and Aeon, because if we breed Chase and Aeon, then there's a good chance we'll get another wheel dog, and we already have a lead dog, and so we, are, we already have two lead dogs, actually, and so pull back just a little bit. Okay, she got it. There we go. Um, but we already have two lead dogs, and so we don't really need another one right away, and uh, so if we get a second... Uh, Oh, there we go. We had to wait for the restock. If we get a second wheel dog, then we can start alternating them out, and that'll be fine. But uh, if we get another lead dog, then we're going to have some problems. So I have a feeling that's what we're going to want to do here. All right. Jump. There we go. Jump quickly. 
Quickly, quickly, quickly. There we go. Oh, stay forward. We don't want anybody getting tangled. Not in this race. All right, nice. Oh, stay forward. Here we go. And just a little bit. To, so if, we, if we're going to try to get them to catch it at the same time, then we need to uh, stagger it a slight bit. So here we go. And that was not right. <laughs> I have to wait and not immediately throw it. All right, we're going to try to get this up to these guys because, there we go, we want to make sure they, they stay on target and uh, aren't getting worn out. Okay, we got tired dogs. Where's the restock? Where's the restock? It's right here. Okay, you guys needed it first. You guys need it next. And jump! <laughs> Just in the nick of time. All right, stay forward. Stay forward. We don't need anybody uh, getting tangled up this time. All right, there's the leading team. We can probably pass them in this amount of time. It doesn't say we're at the end just yet, so I think we can... Oh, there we are. I think we can do it. There we go. All right. There we go. We should get... Do we get fame for finishing? I think we only get fame if it's like a really close finish. So, all right, here we are. Um, rapport up with Sierra, that's good. Rapport up with... Oh, rapport down with Rory, that's what happened. Fatigue capacity is up, fame is up, that's good to see. Alright, everybody's doing pretty well, and so what I think we're gonna do... We have our dues to pay, and actually, I think if we breed our dogs and they're gone, they don't... Then you don't have to register... Then you don't have to pay them in the dues. So, we're gonna try that, because we have 5,000 extra. So, we're going to go ahead... We will um, breed our dogs. We're going to breed Chase. And we're going to breed Aeon. And so, let's see here. Oh, it does have an inbreeding lock a little bit. Uh, I doubt it's that advanced, but like it won't... If we select Aeon, then we can't because they're related. Because it says related. So it does have a little bit of a, an inbreeding thing. I had said it didn't. But uh, we're going to be keeping track of that anyway. Even, even more careful track of it. And we're going to go ahead and breed these two and uh, oh it's 3,000 but we can still do that and I think they'll actually get their fees off of the um like I don't think we'll have to pay their fees either and we have enough for that so there's a good chance of either of these neither are great neither of these are great actually too proud is probably not awful <laughs> uh tangle free and light eater they're not great but we might get another wheel dog and we can always try to get uh, a, a different position and hopefully go for middle. So let's go ahead and we'll confirm this. And we'll hear news from the breeder in four weeks. <laughs> so here we go again. And then we'll end up retiring them shortly after that. But I think that did drop our dues. Did we already pay our dues? When is our, when is our league office... Um... Oh, well, yeah, it's only 10,000 because we don't have, uh, we only have eight dogs to register because the other two are, are gone currently. <laughs> so what we'll want to do is we'll want to wait for them to come back before we, uh, before we go up to the next league. And then we'll probably, we'll let them come back, we'll pay our dues, then we'll go up to the next league, basically. So let's go ahead, we'll uh, maybe try and do one more race. We'll go ahead and let these guys rest. And then before too long, we'll see what the uh, the puppy is going to be like. <laughs> so, uh, let's make sure... No, I keep hitting the wrong button. I keep hitting the wrong button. Oh my goodness. Let's make sure that we go back and we continue to train. And um, we can proceed here. Our bills are due, but we can just pay our dues. Um, and we'll still have some left, which will be actually really, really good. Um, so it's better to breed at higher levels because you get more off of a, you get, it, you'll actually, if you have to pay, t like, if you have to pay 2000 per dog, then the breeding fee is even less, plus you, you, you'll actually gain money pretty much. So let's continue on, and I think we'll do this one last race here. So it's a low exhaustion race pretty much. Let's get white out in the lead, and we'll put, um... We'll put, yeah, we'll put Sierra in the middle here. She's the only natural middle dog we have, so we really want to make sure that we breed her. <laughs> and let's just make sure that everybody is uh, training here. That'll be good. And let's go ahead and start. So Whiteout needs to get more experience. So does Avalanche. At this point, we can trade off with them, I think. But I want to get, um, no, neither of them needed it, actually. <laughs> okay, I'm going to just sit and wait then. 
because I'm gonna do this too fast otherwise. But um, what we need to do now is just build rapport between the dogs and we can work on doing that um, in as many good, like we can, we can work on doing that as much as possible. So let's see here. All right, and you guys submitted, this is, this is probably a good time to mention it, you guys have submitted quite a few names. I'm going to be continuing to use that list, but uh, you're always welcome to submit more, and I'll do my best to use them for the different dogs on the team, especially as we start breeding again. Um, I'll be drawing from that list for uh, the puppy names. So let's go ahead and make sure we jump in time. That was a little bit close, but uh, we did make it. All right. Let's just make sure we wait enough so that uh, we're getting that little bit of speed boost, because that helps a lot. All right, here we go. And here we go. All right, there we are. And we should be able to just jump. And here we go. All right, oops, stay forward. Stay forward. <laughs> we do not need to get tangled up now. We got to make sure we're winning enough. That's the problem here. Um, so let's see. All right, we can do this. I was hoping we wouldn't drop so many ranks, but it's kind of, it makes sense that when you're starting with a newer team that you would drop quite a lot. You know what, you're not actually ready to eat yet. Um, but it makes sense that when you're starting with a newer team, you would drop a few ranks. I'm just hoping we can finally get up to League 7, even though I think that's going to be like insanely difficult. And uh, we just need to push ourselves a little bit more by making sure that uh, we are training our dogs, even when it's a little bit tough. And uh, they're going to kind of just have to jump right in and do the best they can, I think. So let's make sure everybody's doing well. So we got more fame. We got uh, the happiness is still good with everybody. So there we go. Everything's looking pretty good. And next time we'll have to see what the puppy turns out to be, and hopefully we'll be able with that then, um, to, uh, hopefully with that we'll be able to have a dog that's gonna be, if not middle, at least another wheel dog, so Polaris doesn't have to be the only one. And I'll probably will try and run, um, I probably will try and run Avalanche next time. In fact, I'm gonna tweak his harness color because I noticed it is a little bit too bright green. And we generally have more of a grass green. There we go. That's a little bit better. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and wrap up this episode here for today because it is about that time again. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. But until then, this is Jay, over and out.